So I'm just going to share with you this foot massager. I've actually been talking about this, um, I don't know, a couple of weeks or whatever. But this is from Bob and Brad, or it's Bob and Brad Light Foot Massager. It has, um, it can, where it really can, you know, really need your um, massage your your feet really nice. It has heat. It also has air compression. So you can, you know, put it on as intense as you want. It has this like little remote so you can sit there with your feet. I'll show you. I'll superimpose a photo. I was kind of like doing double time. I had it on my feet and I had my hands in my uh, red light therapy that I was doing for my hands. But anyways, back to this. So you, you can step into it. I was with socks. Jay wears socks. And air intensity, you turn the power on and then you can actually turn the heat up higher if you want. Um, you can need, you know, really where it really gets into your, you know, into your feet and really gives you a good workout. Um, and then air intensity makes it tighter. So on button, really cool. Where um, actually Jay is like in love with this thing. And he uses it all the time. It's super light, so it's easy to carry around. You plug it in, you put your feet in each of these, and then you can also see you have the controls here if you, you know, didn't want to use the remote control. But anyways, that was sent to me complimentary. And my gosh, I want to say we've had it for probably a good six, eight weeks. And Jay, at least, has used it every single day. So he's like really loving this foot massager. So I wanted to just share that with you because that is something that was sent to me complimentary. And, um, and so, yeah, and I really like it. But I'm going to let Jay talk about it in a minute. But before I do that, some brands, like for example, I just got... Um, I've gotten a few things from things from um, Current Body. I have the helmet, I have the hands, I have the zip. And um, when they send me stuff, it's kind of interesting. They, they don't have any stipulation. You know, they say, would I be interested in trying this? And I'm a small YouTuber, so it's like every time I get reached out by a company that I'm intrigued by or I've heard about or I've been in envy, envying other women who've reviewed it or used it, you know, I really think about it. And um, so the cool thing about them is they've never put any strings on it. They never say, you have to do a video. It has to be three minutes, 10 minutes. They don't, they don't say anything at all. You know, it, it, here, use it. If you, you know, if you like it, fine. If not, let us know, you know, whatever. But no stipulation. So I find that so interesting. The same thing with my hat that I put on, the red light therapy hat, the hands, um, and now the zip. Um, yeah, there's like, let us know what you think. Use it. And, you yeah, know, I'm like that. So this is going to be something that is going to be massaging. So I use the red light therapy, I use the Nara, and I'm going to be using the Zip. So I am working on my order of how I'm going to do everything. And I'll let you know, because I haven't really started. This just arrived. And I was like, I was tickled pink. You know, it's tickle pink because I do use the Nara almost every single day. And I use my red light therapy almost every single day on my face. So, you know, layering my skincare tools. <laughs> I'm going to layer my skincare, skincare tools. So, yeah, that's what I'm going to be doing. But anyways, I'm going to let Jay talk about this Bob and Brad when he comes in because he really uses it a lot. So that said, stay tuned for Jay. Well, I'm using this foot massager that Monica got, and I'll tell you, I really, really do like it. I've got big feet, so I've got a size 12 here, and they do fit in here nicely. I've got the remote control, and we'll just put the power on. I don't know if you heard that. And then I'm going to do the intensity for the air that comes around the foot. You don't want to do it too much because if you get big feet like mine, it'll crush them. 
do a little needling, kneading, and then we'll put a little heat on. And this will go on for about 15 minutes. So I can feel the product closing around my foot and I can feel underneath my foot all the little pulsatings. Uh, it really feels good and I really, really enjoy it. And how often do you use it? Uh, probably at a minimum twice a day. <laughs> Well, that doesn't hurt, right? It makes your no. feet feel good, makes your legs feel good. Yeah, it really helps. So I enjoy it. Uh, feels good. You mentioned, uh, I think about a week or so ago, that you thought it was helping your knee feel better or something feeling better on your leg when you were massaging your feet. Do you remember? Yeah, I think it, it I just had a hip replacement and my knees are bad too. So when I've used this, it seems to be you know, helping a little bit. I'm not a hundred percent sure, but it could be. And this is Bob and Brad. I don't know if you can hear it. It's like tightening up on you right now, huh? Yeah, it's not bad. And then it does that whole kneading thing and... Yeah, underneath the foot. Cool. So when it closes, you know, it tightens up like a real tight shoe and then you can feel it underneath. So, uh, that's got, awesome. Yeah, it's got a little warmth to it, too. The yeah, heat. the heat. I like that. So I might use it, you know, once every other day or something like that. And I really, really like it. Although the last two times I've used it, I went in for two cycles. It's like 10 minutes a time. Yeah, 10 or 15, I think. I'm not sure. Then you just hit that little button on the remote and it starts all over again. And you can yeah. sit there and do it longer. Yeah. So, um, yeah. That. So the picture that I superimposed a little bit ago, you saw me sitting on the couch with my hands in my current body device and my feet in there that Jay took. And so that was me multitasking. I think out of all of the products that I have reviewed, you have really enjoyed this the most, I would think. Yeah, I remember years ago you had a neck massage thing. Yeah. Uh, but this one's a lot better. Yeah. So great little device and it's light you're going to take it with you on your upcoming adventure yeah yeah <laughs> absolutely yeah. anyways thank you so much jay you're welcome it looks really cool enjoy and so it. there you go he's such a good sport he really he really does enjoy that a lot and i th and i know i said that i thought that was his favorite thing out of all the the products that i've reviewed but once we got these little lanterns and we use them camping a lot, especially when we're so-called dry camping, where we don't, we're not plugged into electricity. And, um, but I think the things that he's used over and over again has been the Built Bars. Really, really loves the Built Bars. But the foot massager, I've never seen him do something as much as, other than golf <laughs> as he does that foot massager. He just absolutely loves it. And, and I'll have to say it definitely is super awesome. So anyways, I'm going to close this video out. I'm really excited to try the Zip Halo. I, have you used it? Have any of you used it? I've, I've read a lot of reviews on it and I've heard a lot of really good things. And I do believe in you know, in, in the fact that it does work your muscles, and I do believe that that can tighten your skin, but like everything, right, has to be consistency. You have to use it a lot. Oh, God bless you. You have to use it a lot. You have to use it all the time, you know, on a consistent basis, I should say. So for me, layering my skincare tools is a challenge, but I'm doing some more research and so that I can really figure out which order it would be best to do everything in. And I'm almost thinking the laser, the, you know, when I do the NARA, that, um, that could be the first thing that I should do. That would mean that I have to adjust when I do my red light therapy. But I'm thinking that um, maybe the red light therapy second, and then the zip halo third but i'm not too sure i'll let you know in an upcoming video what i ended up deciding to do i um i mentioned in one of my last videos that i had gotten a um a really a, a big curling iron and i really like it i've been using it and i've also been using a different dryer brush that i bought um both of them i i really like a lot how they have been 
working on uh, my hair. My, my bio hair is pretty thin, but you can also use them to style wigs, which is what I really like. So on my head right now with Scal, and you've seen this before. This is from um, Ellen Villa, and um, just turn. This is in the color Light Bernstein Rooted, and it's a warmer blend of brown and blonde, and it's pretty close. It's got a little, still a little bit of box hair. I meant to really give it a good soaking, but I just haven't had time. It's been totally crazy. But I'm going to probably do that, uh, give it a good soak, and get rid of some of the box hair. But some of the styling, the curling iron has, um, it can adjust, and it'll be nice big curls, and I can put a little bit more uh, curl in here if I wanted to, and the hot air brush that I got. I'll have to show it to you in one of my upcoming videos. I really like that hot air brush. I, it does not tangle my hair, and it gives me lots of good volume. So I think that's kind of cool. So by the time you see this, Christmas will have been over. Hopefully, I think it'll be before New Year's, and I'll get this up. So I hope you had a wonderful Christmas. Yes, I'm wearing my sweater. If you watch my Christmas video, which was just a little short thing, I'm wearing the same sweater. Um, but by the time you see this, the holidays will be over and uh, at least Christmas will be over. So I hope that you guys had a great Christmas. I am not going to enclose any photos here, but I will probably in my next video is going to be more of a vlog style and I'll share some of my, my holiday pictures and just some other things that we're doing. So anyways, I hope you all have a wonderful time. Thank you so much for joining me and please make sure you like the video please if you have not subscribed and you're watching this hit the subscribe button it would really help me as far as youtube thinking that someone actually wants to watch my video so i would really appreciate it thank you all so much guys and i will see you in 2024 boy that sounds so weird i'm ready to say goodbye to 2023 it has not been the best year so i'm ready Bye-bye, 2023. Anyways, thank you all so much. Love you all. Bye-bye.